Hello everybody, today I'm going to make a video about how to connect your device to your computer using your wireless as a router. Okay, so we, uh, I'm going to make this video for Linux and for uh, Windows and I'm going to release the Windows version tomorrow. So let's begin. Uh, first you go here into your wired network connections or whatever you have. Now, for this to work, you have to have a wired connection and not using your wireless to leave the wireless free so you can use it as a router. You go right click, you go edit connection, then you go wireless and here you see I've already created one but I'm going to add another one. Now you see, first we have to type uh, a name, we go ASD, just to be on the short side. And now for the SSID, remember, don't put the same name uh, as the connection name and the SSID because it won't uh, warn you and it won't work. So you have to put it ASD1 or whatever you want. Then uh, on the mode, go ad hoc and leave everything else automatic, don't touch anything else. On security, now, if you have an older device like an I have, I have a, a device a Nokia, it's a smartphone, N95 and it's a bit old so it doesn't work with the, the newest protocols like um, the, uh, WPA2 and um, it just doesn't want to go, I don't know why, it, maybe it's not supported. <laughs> so um, just to be on the safe side um, and if you don't want to play with it, but if it doesn't work try this. So go on the other one, you need at least five symbols, one, two, three, four, five. Now I already have one connection here on the wired, so uh, this shows up, but uh, if you have only one connection here, one ad hoc connection, this won't, won't be shown here. So co uh, connect automatically, don't forget to leave that. Uh, now here you put on the method share to, share to other computers. This is the most important thing because it won't work if it's not like that. You have the password. Now, you can go with five letters here, but the password should be 10 just to be on the safe side. And save it on your phone or your iPod Touch or whatever. Uh, just to be sure it, uh, it's secure. Okay, so now, as you see, my connection, I've disconnected my connection for so the sole purpose of this video but it will connect automatically every time when you uh, connect to uh, when you log in Linux so if it's not connected because sometimes it happens uh, if it's not connected in, in, or you disconnected it uh, the wireless uh, network uh, will show you like this so to start up the connection you go create you go create new wireless networks and you see here the wireless network and you go here on the connections and you choose your connection here you say create and as you see it starts loading it takes a bit of uh, it takes a while but um, it's not a problem just a bit oh there we go connection established and now we have a connection here on and now I can connect with my phone to this PC so if you like those videos and you want to see more and more will be coming, please rate, comment and subscribe. See you later.